Hello, my name's Samuel Norris. Today I'll be auditioning for the BA in Professional Acting. I'm going to be performing an extract from a play called The Last of the Housemans by Stephen Beresford, in which I play a character called Nick. Throughout the whole play, he's been quite introverted and bottled up all of his emotions, and this is the scene in which he finally unleashes and exerts all of his frustrations towards his mother. It's a monologue which I've compiled together from one scene. Uh, I'm more than happy for this to be used in the audition process. I hope you enjoy. We need to start living in the real world. That's a fairly new development, wouldn't you say? Oh, tell me. Tell me about the real world, Mother Darling. I'm, I'm fascinated to know. When would you say you first discovered it, hmm? When you're playing Hindu holy men with all the other brats? We lived in the real world, Mum! Me and Libby! We lived here with your f parents, didn't we? And there was nothing more real, nothing, than your fucking vicious fucking father! So don't you dare talk to me about the real world! And, and you say you did what you thought was best? Oh, please. You know, I like living in India. Libby didn't, but I did. I liked it. Why didn't you get rid of her if she was so unhappy? I would have stayed. I wanted to stay. And then Libby, tell her. Tell her what it was like. It was... <laughs> and the cause. Well, that's what's so hilarious. The great cause you were fighting for. Your shining cause. I'll tell you about your bloody cause, Mum. You say you were trying to change an unjust society. And I know you were. But let's just... Would you mind if I take a quick assessment? Hmm? I think when something is so important that you would abandon your own children for it, we can be permitted a little stock take, can't we? No sign of peace or equality here, I'm afraid. No justice. But what's this? Henna tattoos are still making an impact. Yeah, that's something. Uh, yoga, yeah, yeah. Wholemeal bread. And the drugs, of course. And what's this? Steel Eye Span are still touring the globe. Well, that's a comfort, isn't it? At least your revolution wasn't entirely in vain. Because I don't know if you noticed, Mum, but while you were wanking into a chrysanthemum, Margaret Thatcher made her entrance, didn't she? Did you see? Ronald Reagan, Jesse Helms. Now that was a revolution. They knew the terrain, darling, scorched earth. Jesus Christ, you hippies. You could have learnt a thing or two about changing the world from those people.